Okay, this is a quick part two. Netflix, the TV show called Lucifer. Um, the guy here that plays Lucifer goes back at the end of this episode, the last episode of season four, right? He ends up going back and being Lord of Hell. He leaves Earth and leaves his girl and his friends and the people he loves, right? Because he does care about people in this episode and protect the people he cares, most cares about, right? And who's left as a baby boy to govern the earth as the Lord of Hell? This is what the demons now re re reverence, this new baby boy, an African American, as the new Lord of Hell on earth. And so we have this depiction of Lucifer being the Lord of Hell itself, eternal, e downstairs, the et eternal, infernal place called Hell. And topside, there's a representation of Lucifer is the African American baby boy who's half angel, half man in this crazy, bizarre Warner Brothers Netflix TV show on Lucifer. It mirrors reality in more ways than you can imagine, okay? And season five is about to come out, or they've just listed the amount of episodes that it's going to be within season five, and fans of this TV show are awaiting its release this year or next year. Um, so there you have it, folks. From the last episode, who's the, who's the new king of hell? Two, Inauguration Day is... 13 days, 1 year and 8 months. Where do you find those numbers? In Revelation 13, 18, the 666 verse in the King James Bible. Here is wisdom. Let him that hath understanding count the number of the beast, for it is the number of a man, and his number is 666. Brock Hussein Obama. Thanks for listening.